My name is Isaac Alonji, and I was the director of photography for the movie Freddy. The script is just full of great visuals, which is what every cinematographer wants. I'm a big fan of Stranger Things and Goonies, and to have the opportunity to have these kids running around this small town, riding their bikes, it was really exciting for me. I think it's really important on each project to have a style that works for that project. I don't like to push my own look on things. Um, I like to just read the script and kind of go with what feels right for that specific project. The director had a great vision. The producer had a great vision for how the film would look. Just a little more of like a retro throwback. We are making some atmosphere happen. We all felt like this film needed that more nostalgic, soft, cinematic look. Come on through. Uh... So we brought in a hazer from Great Britain, used on Game of Thrones and other big shows like that, and it really added an amazing feeling. It was really important to the director and I that the camera be moving when it was a motivated shot. We had a steady cam operator on set that did a fantastic job, but we also used some other things like the little Osmo. Um, it's a little raw 4K camera she can handhold. It looks beautiful. We also put it up on the drone and flew that around. You really want to be careful that you don't make it look too much like a drone shot, so maybe you put longer lenses on and get kind of further away. Now I'm gonna go get that top shot ready. All of the drone shots in Freddy were shot on set, on the day. Um, that way we had the talent and the props, and it just adds to the production value. One of my favorite locations was Cooper Chapel. It's kind of out buried in the woods and it's this all glass chapel that just had an incredible feeling and the light just streaming in through the glass on the roof. It turned out incredibly well.